In today's video, I will teach you how to open PSD files in GIMP. Let's get started. Adobe Photoshop's popularity has made its native PSD or Photoshop document file format widely used. And while GIMP supports opening PSD files, there are limitations, especially with files created in newer versions of Photoshop. So can GIMP open a PSD file? The simple answer is yes. GIMP can open PSD files created by Photoshop or other applications using the PSD format. However, compatibility issues may arise with PSD files from recent Photoshop versions due to GIMP's last major update in 2018. So here's how to open PSD file in GIMP. First, launch GIMP, then open the file menu and click open. Or use the keyboard shortcut key Ctrl O for Windows and Command O for Mac. Then select the PSD file. Navigate to the PSD file, then click open. GIMP may ignore advanced features like adjustment layers and smart filters in PSD files. Some items might also unintentionally convert to pixel layers. The final display in GIMP may differ from Photoshop due to missing or altered elements. GIMP is not the only non-Photoshop editor that can open PSD files, but many share similar limitations. If advanced features are crucial, consider alternative options. The first one is Photoshop on web. Adobe offers a web version of Photoshop accessible through web browsers like Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge. While not as powerful as the desktop version, it can properly open PSD files, and it also requires a free Adobe account. The second option is Photoshop Free Trial. Download the full version of Photoshop for a free 7-day trial. It provides access to all features without missing layers or adjustments, but it also requires a free Adobe account. But don't worry, because no payment information is needed for the trial. Opening a PSD file in GIMP is straightforward. But for complex files with advanced Photoshop features, alternative methods like Photoshop on the web or a free trial may be necessary. GIMP's limitations stem from the lack of major updates since 2018, making some advanced Photoshop features incompatible. Understanding these options allows users to access and work with PSD files in GIMP or explore alternative solutions based on their specific needs. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.